Free Science Lessons Investigating Enzymatic Reactions You can investigate the effect of pH on enzyme activity. The enzyme amylase catalyzes the breakdown of starch to maltose. It's easy to detect starch using iodine solution. If starch is present, the iodine solution will change from brownie orange to blue black. This is how you can investigate how pH affects amylase activity. First, put a drop of iodine solution into every well of the sporting tile. Then place a Bunsen burner on a heatproof mat and a tripod and gauze over the Bunsen burner. Put a beaker of water on top of the tripod and heat the water until it is 35 degrees Celsius. Try to keep the temperature of the water constant throughout the experiment. Use a syringe to add 1 cm cubed of amylase solution and 1 cm cubed of a buffer solution with a pH of 5 to a boiling tube. Using test tube holders, put the tube into the beaker of water and wait for 5 minutes. Next, use a different syringe to add 5 cm cubed of a starch solution to the boiling tube. Immediately mix the contents of the boiling tube and start a stopwatch. Use continuous sampling to record how long it takes for the amylase to break down all of the starch. To do this, use a dropping pipette to take a fresh sample from the boiling tube every 30 seconds and put a drop into a well. When the iodine solution remains brownie orange, starch is no longer present. Repeat the whole experiment with buffer solutions of different pH values to see how pH affects the time taken for the starch to be broken down. Remember to control any variables each time to make it a fair test. Here's how to calculate the rate of reaction. It's often useful to calculate the rate of reaction after an experiment. Rate is a measure of how much something changes over time. For the experiment we just talked about, you can calculate the rate of reaction using this formula. If an experiment measures how much something changes over time, you can calculate the rate of reaction by dividing the amount that has changed by the time taken. If you haven't already, please subscribe, like and share.